appeared to be perspiration on the floor. And then turns it over. Farrell with numbers the other way, three on two if he hurries. Finds the trailer, it's Brownridge for three, and he drills it. Not as much as when he's with the big club. Yeah, the only thing they're probably telling him to do is make sure you get X amount of shots. Oliver inside, lays it in. It's very, very true. He didn't come to Syracuse, though. He went to George Washington, did tremendous things there. Brownridge attacks the cup. I have a question for you. Yes. It's a shoot for Delaware. Brownridge gets a screen from Oliver. He attacks the oh, cup with authority. Cameron Oliver says, get out of my way. But not without some flair. First, it was Cameron Oliver who just says, eh, I'll take that. And then Willie Reed, barrel the other way. Brown Ridge. Inside Oliver again. He lives above the rim. He's got real estate. This is the most recent one. Nice yeah. pass from Brown Ridge. This is calm. What are, that's what you want out of a possible role player for a team. Spencer Dinwiddie was a, as Farrell hits a shot was an example that you, the poor kid, it, it would be worth it for his fame. <laughs> Brown Ridge got it. That was, that was a great play out of timeout. Either in a suit somewhere or not playing at all. And this gives him a chance to play. Oliver attacks the rim with aggression and lays it in. I think that's a good point because you know, being able to take charges, you know, he's really extremely vocal on defense right there, Bradley. But just learn from your veterans. Like you said earlier, be a sponge that every single day, just playing every possession like it's my last. It took me a while to learn. Anderson finishes. And I think that's that's something that is impressive. Brownridge, the response goes down. Three-point contest so far in this third quarter. And GMs and scouts and such. Five seconds to shoot. Randall gives it out. Brownridge a three. That's big for Jared Brownridge. Gets his team back within four.